Look at this, the floor is almost done. And it almost looks like we might have enough boards or very close to it. And John is helping me and we're trying to see how much work we can get done tonight. I don't, we probably won't finish tonight, but we'll probably get pretty close. And then if we'd finish that, we also have the closet to do. I have these boards here. We found them by the side of the road, uh, it's separate from these boards. Uh, but we found them and they're free and they're darker. They don't match with these boards we have. So I'm just, I, I'm putting them in the closet so that and there's enough to do the closet, I think. So the total we paid for all this wood is free. It's late and I'm ready to head to bed. I'll show you what I got done. We're done all the way up to there. I just have uh, two more rows of wood to put in. We also have to do the closet and we'll do that tomorrow. Good morning. Today is Saturday and Janelle and all the girls are leaving to go somewhere for probably about two or three hours. So the boys and I are going to work really hard and we're going to try to make it worth uh, their time leaving. Because uh, when everyone leaves and we have good time, we try to work as fast as we can, get the job done. And I think today we are probably going to almost finish the room, other than woodwork and doors. Hopefully today we can have the boys in their room and the girls in the new room and we can do away with the fold up bed. Yes, because this has pretty thin, I, I'm tough, but this has pretty thin of a mattress. It's okay, but... It'd be nice to get out of there after a month. The girls are all loaded up and ready to go. There they go. And it's really cold today and you can tell it's cold because the rhododendron leaves uh, curl up tightly when it gets cold. Now the boys and I are going to go full speed and we are going to see how much work we can get done. Full speed ahead! <coughs> Let's go! I'll show you what we have to do today and we'll see if we can get it done. We just have two more boards to put in and we're probably going to Curtis today, see if we can buy some. We have to lay the boards in the closet and I'm hoping we have enough of those dark boards. Look at this nail. It looks like it's probably for like a tree stand. We just went downstairs to get the table saw and we had to cut this because this wouldn't fit into here because we had to cut that. And now Dad is doing it. And I think we're going to finish soon. And did you know what Daddy did last night? He only has two boards left. There and there and around here. He's a, mommy is at, what is it called? Lula Low. Mommy's at Lula Low with our neighbor and grandma and gra with grandma. The girls just got home and I got that done there. And also he touched up a few places. Uh, you can see right there. It needed to get touched up. So we got a little work done. Putting in the last board. It's not the last board, but the last board in the closet. But last night, Daddy finished the whole this thing, except for a, a little square over here. These are the nailed in. These are the dark boards. If Curtis doesn't have these boards, we'll just use the darkest, lightish. And we need two more rows right here. And then we're done. And then we just have to paint. You're not going to believe what we're doing. Uh, someone called us. This is the lady that uh, is in charge of the nursing home where John does his bird reports. And she says that they have a baby bird in distress and the parents aren't taking care of it. And she asked if we could uh, see what we could do. So we are headed over there right now. Uh, kind of like a, a bird emergency. Mm -hmm. And John and Peter are with me too. We're gonna try to see if we can save this bird. I do not know what kind of bird is, it is. I think uh, the house bird. All I know is that if we don't do anything, the bird is going to die. And if we do something, well, the bird is probably going to die. So I figured we'll take the probably over the sure. John made a nest for the bird it's right a there. Temporary nest. We're at the place and we're going to get the bird. We'll see if it's still alive or not. First got it, it was skinless. Uh, I mean, it was just skin. Oh, it's tiny. It's teeny tiny. What wow. type of bird is that? 
I think it's a finch. Which that's one was the meeting? Okay, we that's think the this is the naughty the mama who won't watch her birds. Yeah. Okay, so that's so that's the parents are right up there. You live, little girl, okay, or little boy? Okay, by God's grace. Okay, there's there's your new papa. Okay. All right. We're headed out to the car. The, it's really cold out, so John's trying to keep the bird warm. And the bird's really small, like teeny. Really small. I didn't think it was going to be that small, but it is tiny. I got the door. We got our bird, and we're headed home. Uh, the lady's husband is going to get try to get some bird food and bring it over to our house. And uh, what else did she say? Latex in a bird lot. cage. I don't and know if she's going to need a bird and cage no or not. Do baby birds even have no. beaks? That's crazy. Yes. No. Why aren't there more? Is there the... It did. No, well, this is all I've got. Two John. hours ago. Is that two hours ago? It just yeah. hatched and the mother kicked it out? Yes. That's awful. It is. Ooh. We saw the bad mother. The bad, he saw the bad mother. Okay, there. Mommy's being a good mother. Mommy is trying to feed it some warm water. You're going to have to actually open your hand up a little bit more, John. Move it. Peep, 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 peep. Come on, honey. Oh. Mm. Mommy just kicks it out and expects to get away with it. His neck is tiny. His neck is like a Come on. Move an inch. Peep, 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 peep. Oh, he's striking it. Now I'm calling my sister who was a vet and we'll see if she knows what to do. And she also loves birds and she has a pet bird. Can I talk to her? You want to talk to Aunt Becky? You might be able to. We're having a hard time finding food for the baby bird, uh, but Janelle found a formula on the internet that we can make and she just has to go to CVS and get some Pedialyte. So she'll be back shortly and we'll make that up and see if the bird will eat it. Janelle is reading your recipe and they said in an emergency you can use baby food. We got baby food. <laughs> Janelle is going to take some baby food and mix it with Pedialyte and we're going to see if the bird eats it. That's like more than the weight of the bird right there. Yeah I know. It's not, I don't need much. Yeah, the bird is so tiny. Doesn't that look delicious? <laughs> oh yes. Can I have some? <laughs> no. Because uh. it would taste gross you would be dead by the time you eat it. Yeah, it's but they wouldn't kill you. I mean, you probably could. You could have What? Okay. You know, John, we are trying our best. I know. We are doing best. as good as we can. Be. Let's see if the birdie will eat it. Okay. He has a bird trap. He has a bird trap? Yes. Okay, cover okay. him up. Cover him up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> that thing could fix her there. You guys have fun. <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Greg. <laughs> I just don't know how I'm going to get it to open its mouth, John. He peeped. And mommy is trying to feed it. Feed it. And our, I'm the person that works at the home. The, home they gave us this the bird cage um gloves and food is he eating is the baby eating is the look at the baby wings see the baby wings oh yeah cute they said don't get over the breathing holes well, it oh, it just opened his mouth. <gasps> oh. Oh, 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 come on. Come on, little fella. It's opening its mouth. It's come feet. on, little fella. <gasps> come on. Yes, that's why they put it there. The bird is eating a little bit. Not, not much, but he's a really little bird, so. Be careful about his feet. If nothing else, the kids are enjoying the cage. Feeding number two. And he's doing really well. Beep, beep. Oop. Yeah, this this is really funny looking. Watch beep, this. Beep, 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 beep. Yep. Well, Cam is having a hard time focusing on the tiny little bird. Let's see. Just zoom out. Beep, 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 beep. Might be done. Well, I think he's full. Beep, 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 yeah, he's full. Beep, 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 beep. 
He's full. He acts tired. Let's see if he opens his mouth. He's tired. I made a brooding box, and once it gets up to temperature, we're going to put the Mostly little birdie the in there. 85. Okay, we're getting there. It's about 9.30, and we've been running around doing this and that and trying to keep the bird alive, and the bird is still alive. But now it's finally time to paint the room. I was hoping to have that done long ago, but well, anyway, duty calls. And the bird is sleeping. We'll show you the bird. It's sleeping. Yeah. If, it's there like an inch long and a half inch wide, at least around its neck. Because it's really little. It's like, here's its head. Brr, bee, tiny, and then it gets bigger. And it has tiny, tiny wings like that big. It's actually really cute. And it still has its sack, his yolk sack. And what does it do with the yolk sack? Well, I don't know. It saves up energy for the bird. Yeah. We've been feeding it a lot because it stays hydrated. Janelle and I discussed what we're going to do with the bird tonight, and we think that John and I are going to get up every two hours and feed it. And then we'll see what happens from there. Hopefully the bird lives through the night, but we'll see what happens. I mean, it, it's already lasted longer than I thought it was going to, and it seems to be reasonably healthy at least. Birdie's going to spend the night in our room tonight, and Janelle is uh, making a box. Yep. And putting a thermometer in there, and there's some water to keep it moisturized. Or uh, keep it humidified, I guess. And it's all on top of a heating pad. Yeah, and it's gonna have a light for the time being. We're gonna get it hotter in there, and then. Yeah, poor little birdie's getting kind of. Birdie's a little cold. We'll see if this works. The box that we had downstairs was not keeping it up to temperature whatsoever, so it's on the hot heating pad. I put hot water in there for now, so it's you know starting out warm. And then I have the light bulb. We may end up um, getting rid of the light bulb if the heating pad's enough. But usually we have time to warm up our brooder when we're doing chickens, but we didn't have that with this guy, so it's kind of makeshift, at, and we're just doing the best we can. Janelle is feeding the little guy for one last time tonight. And then she's going to bed, and then I have uh, feeding duty for the night. I didn't get quite as much in the room done as I was hoping to get done today, uh, but the, I did paint the ceiling. So I'm going to end the video here. I hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you tomorrow.